Today, we're in Manchester. We're gonna play from the forward tees. 5276. Current handicaps are 14-6, 10-6, 5 Course handicap, eight, four, and plus one. Boom! Get in there, get in there! Yeah! One over, one over, two over. So, Pretty, that's not terrible. Not yeah. terrible, we can all definitely hit our mark. We got a par four, which is definitely a par three. A long, long par, par three. 210, I was right on. I mean, if there's a par three, I'd probably par it very rarely. Very, yeah, bogey. Like, like, like 18, very rarely par it. Get that left kick, yep. hell yeah. Oh, stop now though. That's a good roll. Ah. Yes. Oh. chances of making this. Less than five percent. I don't think he hit it hard enough. Maybe he did. It's a good pot from there. Very nice. Good two putt. Yeah. You know what this is? This is when you tried to show off and hit a gap wedge. You yeah. came up 30 yards short. You think you're real good. Yeah. There you go. Great shot. Bye. Give it to him. Get it. Oh. What the f How are you feeling? Frustrated. Just can't putt today. Yeah, this is definitely a day where like you gotta You wanna be able to putt, that's for sure. And I just haven't been dropping putts all day. You so know, it. even if you hit a bad tee shot, you're still a short iron out on most of this. So it's so it really it really comes down to just finishing the hole. I mean, that's what it is, it's just finishing.
Smart play. Get in there. Oh. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. And um, I think we're all like, st like ah, I don't know. We're all kind of like we need we need it we need a score here. We haven't been none of us have been scoring in a long time. Kind of just stringing it along. Just stringing it along. I just put one in the water. Time to make some moves. I just gotta walk away with a par on this hole. Bogey at the worst. The next hole, the next hole, like we should probably see an eagle from somebody. Oh. I mean, it's on the green. But that's I think people think that when you move up, you know, 40, 30 yards a hole, it's going to make it a lot easier. And it does in some aspects if you're hitting the right shots. But if you can't get on the green and put it close and make putts, you're not still not going to score well. So it's still it's golf. You still got to finish the hole. You yeah, got to get still, it in. It's still golf in that sense that you have to execute and hit shots to score it's not like because you move up 30 yards you're automatically bogey birdieing every hole you know good lag oh that was laugh at how absurdly short this next par five dude is. this par five is sh shorter than the next par four it's shorter than 16. i think it's shorter than 17 too it's crazy that they still keep it a par five i mean yeah. i know this is for like kids this green is definitely a lot tougher than the next and it is all uphill too and it's all uphill it's guarded in the front by bunkers the green's elevated Stay out of there for him. Yep. Oh, you chucked it. Get over the trip. It's gonna catch that slope. Catch that slope. Get some legs! in the same spot. <laughs> Closest to the pin? Ooh. 
There you I gotta go. make that putt though. Good That's shot. the thing. Always fix your divots. Always. You gotta charge it to the game. Come on, baby. Oh. 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 Beauty, beauty. Cam, I'm right with you. Run, baby, run! Get up there! It might get up there. It's get up there. Oh, baby. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I, that was a terrible filming shot. Oh, that's a terrible putt. Come on, touch burning sands, cross lands in. Storm is sure, sure, seasons in the year, yeah. Ain't no channel for champions and chain no fear. Yep, the champ is here, switch gears. We keep the haters in the rear. At the blood, sweat, and tears, and my goal so near. I see my victory. Depending on how far you're hitting it on these shorter, shorter holes, like sometimes the landing zone now, there if you miss it right or left, there's more trouble inside a hundred yards in your landing zone versus if you hit it the same distance but from 50 yards back. It's a day, we break through. It's a day, we break through. It's a day, we break through. I know it's lonely yet the tell. But that's not by speculation. But the position that I got, I climb too high to fall, way too hard to drop. Stop clocks on the speed bag. Every oh, year, okay, I'm pushing no jet lag. This is greater than trophies and saluted flags. Titans of pain, the cost is paid. Yay, I, I, I give it the cost I made. Deal with the dealer. Maybe the hand was played. New level, next stage. Ooh. Learn to play the legend. Now tell me what's my next stage. It's a real score. Yeah. You really played. You just play from the different tees. Like there's That's nothing. True. That's true. That's so true. my my differential is an 11.7, 77. So five over is an 11.7. Yeah. So that had me at a 12.7 differential out of 78 from the greens. Even par from the forward tees here at Manchester is a what differential? 6.7. What did you guys, what did we all think about this challenge? It was fun, first and foremost. Like, it's just a different way to play the golf course. And I think if you went into it with more of a mindset working on your game, because I think that's what it's really good for, as opposed to where I think we all just went out and tried to... Overpower it, of course. Yeah, overpower the course, go for the best score we could, when really I think it's a good way to practice different parts of your game. It's one of those things also where it can teach you to play a hole a different way if you're playing course that you play often and you decide to play the forward tees and you may end up in a different position you know whether you're taking an iron off the tee just to put it out there it can kind of show you that maybe you don't need to hit a driver off a lot of holes you know to focus a lot more on planning for your next shot and putting yourself in position for the next shot. As we all found out, I mean, you could try and kill the ball, but that doesn't necessarily mean you're going to be in a better spot than you were if you were playing the blue tees. Uh, obviously, it was a ton of fun to be in totally different positions of the golf course than we never are, especially off the tee. Like, that was super cool. I think it's a great way to practice short game. Like, even more so than just, you know, on a regular round. And obviously, like, like... Justin said and you kind of alluded to like different clubs off different tees playing to different yardages and stuff like that you have to think more about that and maybe most of us might not think of that right away like obviously we didn't but I think that we definitely did get great short game practice just by going out and playing those tees without even having to really think about it. Mm -hmm.